Like the old saying goes, there's more than one way to do Windows on mobile, and the latest very shiny iteration comes from Acer. I'm Michael Fisher with Pocket Now, and this is a first look at the Acer Jade Primo, brought to you by dbrand. It may be new to the hands-on scene, but the Acer Jade Primo was actually one of the first Windows 10 mobile phones announced back at IFA 2015 a few months back. This is the first chance we've had to go hands-on, though, and the Primo does pack a surprise or two within its familiar shell. On the downside, this is a lot like other Acer phones we've seen over the years. Plastic build with a faux metallic hairline finish and super gloss coating, uh, very lightweight and thin construction, and speakers that look a lot like sink drains. It's okay, it's not bad, but not much more than that. And it's hardly the kind of top-notch industrial design that a new platform like Windows 10 Mobile needs to make a splash. But you know what? The bar hasn't been set terribly high by the competition, at least not yet. So if you're looking for something that at least looks a bit higher end, the Jade Primo might be your game. And it's not just looks. Just as it does on the Lumia 950, the Snapdragon 808 processor runs Windows 10 Mobile like a champ here. It doesn't hurt that it's backed up by 3 gigs of RAM, which will likely help it when running Continuum. It's one of a very few phones to do so at this point on Windows. Factor in a 21 megapixel camera, LTE Category 6, and an absolutely gorgeous 5.5 inch Super AMOLED display at Full HD, and it's tough not to get excited about this phone if you're a fan of Windows 10 Mobile. Acer says the specs are subject to change depending on market, and it's unclear at this point whether the phone will support things like Windows Hello. Price and availability stateside are similarly TBD. We'll look forward to learning more. There's more coming from PocketNow at CES 2016, including more from the Windows Mobile Camp. Stay tuned both here on YouTube and at PocketNow.com. Until next time, this has been Michael Fisher with Hayato Husman behind the camera. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.